Well, getting back to weather now as we take another live look outside through a holiday in Cam. Beautiful day outside. Nice sunny weather. Blue skies. Meteorologist Allison Pryor is live in the Storm Alert Center with an extended look at the forecast. Allison? Yeah, it was a great start to the official day of summer. We hit a high of 92 in Chattanooga today after a low of 65 this morning. We're a little bit of abbreviated due to the Belmont Stakes, so I'll have your Sky Watcher numbers coming up at 11 o'clock this evening. Just remember for this evening, if you're heading out, we are looking at those mostly sunny skies. Any kind of storms are staying just outside of our area and it will be a warm evening ahead sunset tonight at 8 58 p.m. I do want to talk to you though about Father's Day. Here's the severe outlook for the day tomorrow. You'll notice main activity further to the west, but look at this right around Middle Tennessee uh, extending up into Kentucky. That's a level one marginal risk. Now it's just outside of our area. We're mainly looking at general thunderstorms, but I want to kind of just plant this in your ear. If you're not some of our western counties, Marion, Grundy, Sequatchie, Bledsoe, Ray County, you need to probably have a heads up. We are looking at some storms across our area for about 2 p.m. to 7 p.m. You may be seeing some stronger ones. So I wanted to just give you that earlier warning about that. And it looks like our rain chances are really going to be increasing for the day on Sunday. So again, quiet conditions overnight tonight. Those mostly sunny skies. Not really much is going to be happening during the nighttime hours for tomorrow morning. It'll be a quiet, nice start to the day. Mostly sunny again. We'll have nice weather pretty much through lunchtime for Father's Day. So if you want to do something outside, morning hours are great. But by 1, 2 o'clock, we'll Look at these storms across the area. Each individual one is going to be small in size, so they will be hit and miss, but the overall coverage is becoming more widespread. You'll notice with those pockets of that red and even purple colors, those are those heavier downpours we're going to have. That's um, lightning with this, some gusty wind. Those are kind of the main threats for our area. Continuing into about 6 p.m. and then after about 7 o'clock, pretty much wrapping up. Then as you start the work week, quiet weather once again on Monday morning as we head into Monday afternoon starting up about three o'clock on Monday. We'll again have these scattered thunderstorms across our area moving into the evening hours as well. So a kind of an increased trend for the rain chances for tomorrow and on Monday. For tonight, we're looking at 68 degrees for that overnight low. It will be a warm evening ahead. Potential for some patchy fog to develop again after 3 a.m. Tomorrow, 90 degrees for your high. Yes, it'll be nice in the morning for Father's Day. But you need to watch out for those storms for the afternoon and into the evening. Have those chances at 50% on Sunday, 40% on Monday. Increased again for Tuesday and Wednesday. That's associated with the cold front, so a little bit cooler on Wednesday. And then drier weather to end the week. So big news for Father's Day tomorrow. Yes, you can be outside in the morning, but stay weather aware for the afternoon. Joy, back to you. All righty. Thank you, Allison.